Hey Libra, this is Star. Welcome to your Valentine's Day love reading. Happy Valentine's Day to all of you. All right, let's get started. Let's see what's going on between you and your person or your person of interest. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising. Okay. Hmm. Um, I kind of feel like you guys may have been friend zoned or yeah i feel like it was you or it was a relationship you know that where you had a, a romantic connection but then it turned into a friendship or it turned platonic it kind of died off um and there seems to be regret or sadness you don't want that to happen you want to go back to this person let's see let's see what this person's energy is Yeah, so at the bottom we have the Three of Cups. I feel like whoever it is that you're dealing with, this person, they have feelings for you. They, they There is affection there, but they have a hard time um, staying committed. Okay, this is somebody who could be addicted to the excitement. Um, I do feel like at times, I feel like this person may come back into your life. Okay, but it's going to be somewhat of a test. They may come back soon, actually, within three days, three weeks, um, because they want you back in their life. And I, I feel like their intention is to stop that kind of behavior, you know, that that uh, constantly looking for um, the next best, best thing, um, needing to have, you know, a variety of people at their disposal. They're trying to get away from that. But at the end of the day, that is who they are. At this moment, I don't feel like they've matured that yet. I feel like that's very much a part of who they are. They may be um, in the process, maybe they may be on that journey to at some point be someone who can commit. But right now, I just I, I, I don't really see it. I think they have the intention, but the follow through is not there. And the reason I say that is because, yes, they I do feel like they're going to come toward you because they miss you. They want you in their life. Um, but they're just not going to measure up. I just, I just feel like they don't put enough effort, or they, they just don't even know how. <laughs> okay, uh, regardless of their age, some of them are really young. But regardless of their age, even if they're not all that young, um, they're just not at that point in life. So let's get some more information here with the unto untold truths of the heart oracle. Let's see what this person could be dealing with. What does Libra need to know about this? Let me actually pick these cards up. What does Libra need to know about this connection? What do they need to be aware of? So at the bottom, we have upheaval, shock, the unexpected trouble. I viewed this as the tower card. So this could have been, you know, the breakdown of your connection. You guys may have felt like rejected by this person just by their behavior. There's a lot of passion between the two of you, but it's not really enough. Yeah, definitely a lot of passion a little bit of um, obsessive energy. So, so very lusty, very, very lustful energy here. 
And again, we have, so here, you know, we had that shock, unexpected trouble, and then we have tension here, turbulence, arguments, stress. You guys do have, you know, whatever memories you have with this person, you, you, got, you had a good time. You know, you had a good time. You, um, they gave you those butterflies. But at the end of the day, like I said, they, they fall short. Um, so, yeah, and I feel like... I feel like once that initial lust and, you know, that energy, once that dies down, that's when this person starts to back away. They find a million and one things that are wrong with you or that are wrong with the connection. It's not the right time, you know, and that's why they, they end up pushing you away. Now, I don't feel like they've, completely expressed how they truly feel for you because I do I think there's feelings there but again not enough to keep this going long term so it just seems like a temporary um, sort of connection to me I don't feel like this is one that you should be putting too much too much emphasis on spending too much time on sorry I wish I, had, I wish I had better news for Valentine's Day but I think it is good news because it's better to know and, and, and to just know what it is you're dealing with and move on and, and look for something that, or for somebody who um, can give you what it is that you need rather than, you know, having some tarot reader tell you all kinds of things to keep coming back to the channel. And yet it's really not the truth. So let's get some um, messages from the angels of love. And this doesn't necessarily have to be with regards to this particular person. It's just messages with regards to love in general. What is the guidance for Libra? Sorry, these are so big. Oh, there we go. Okay. All right, yeah, so we have love and doors. Yeah, I wanted to see if we had others. Let me just finish shuffling here, and then I'll, I'll read off the cards. Okay. At the bottom, we have actions speak loudly. Express your love through actions. Yeah, I feel like with this person, you really have to look at what they have done, how they have treated you, rather than all the you know, sweet nothings that they've whispered in your ear in, in those intimate moments or whatever, because, you know, people will say anything in during those times or in those intimate moments. So it's really important to keep in mind what this person has actually demonstrated. We have here love endures. Love does not give up or lose faith. Love is hopeful and withstands every situation. And we have the heart of the matter. There is more going on than meets the eye. Recognize what this is all about. Yeah. So even though you want to see the best side of this person, there's, there's, there's more there. Okay. And usually when people demonstrate this type of behavior, it's, it's, it's an attachment, a detachment style of, of um, connecting. Um, it's somebody who is afraid to get too involved, too intimate with someone. They're, they're afraid to be seen, really. Um, and so we have to recognize that. That is this person's journey. They need to deal with that on their own. It's not for you to fix them. And so the cards are kind of suggesting that if this person has not shown that they are, they have faith in this relationship, if they have not, you know, if this, they haven't remained hopeful um, if this relationship hasn't withstood every situation, clearly not, because I feel like you guys are sort of in separation. Um, it's just, it's not what you thought it was, or it's not what you're, you're looking for. And so there's more to the story, but I, I feel like it's not for you to fix Libra. So that is your Valentine's Day message. Like I said, I wish it could have been juicier, but that's what it is. Um, if you guys are interested in a private reading, excuse me, contact me at eyesofthestarstarot at gmail.com. Otherwise, I'll see you guys here next time.
Love you guys. Bye.